So I'm going to show you how to tether T-Mobile's new HD2. This is the US version um, with Bluetooth and I'm going to tether it to the Mac. No drivers needed, nothing. Uh, just go to start settings. So then you go to the menu on the bottom, uh, all settings. And then from all settings, uh, you click the Bluetooth. It's just telling you that Bluetooth is off, so you want to turn it on. Uh, I say yes on the bottom. Uh, and then, considering you'll have your Bluetooth on on your Mac already, you just say add device and it'll search for it. And when it finds your Mac, uh, you just can click on the computer that, that you see there on the top. And then once you click on that, it's going to ask for a code to put in. And you'll have to put in the special security code. Um, and this is just a, a pair of the two devices together. So I'm just going to put one, two, three, four. That's fine, uh, just for demonstration. And then uh, the pop-up will pop. It'll come up on the Mac. You take a look and just enter the same code that you entered before: one, two, three, four, and say pair. And then the two devices will pair each other. Uh, so give it a second. All right, it's paired. And then we have to go up to the settings now under Bluetooth. So we go open Bluetooth preferences. And then we'll go to our device that we paired it with. And then we'll say advanced. And then here's the trick. you got to add, push the plus on the bottom to add the serial port. And then the say OK. The, the check boxes there are fine. Uh, and then they should be paired up. Um, so you can share your internet connection from your phone to your computer. You give it a second and it says connected. Yeah, that's fine. Um, and it looks like it verified it. So now we'll go back to the phone under the uh, the original Bluetooth settings that we were in. Um, and then the middle here shows the, the device that it's paired with and it says Bluetooth networking. The first time you do this you have to set it up. So right now it's just checking and it says we want to not create a private network but we want to share the internet connection and then continue. And T-Mobile data is fine. Um, and then it'll try and connect and then it says connected and that's it so now you go to your browser on the Mac and I go to Google and since I'm on edge it's nice and slow here and there we go and wireless isn't on and it's tethered using Bluetooth that's uh, all there is to it so for my uh, disclaimer here T-Mobile and other carriers don't let you tether uh, it's against their terms of service so I'm just doing a proof of concept and uh, just an informational how-to video.